So I want to know what it's like to grind to max level with a fruit that's worse than dragon. Of course, I'm talking about the control fruit here. So yeah, in this video, we're going to go from this level one new all the way to the max level with control, as well as obtain the zebra cap and the cocoa sword. All right, now, obviously, I just created this account. I don't have anything on it, but I did load it up with $50 worth of Robux to go ahead and buy that thing from the Blockster's dealer right here. I don't even check out how expensive this thing is, so I might end up shocked, but I bought so many fruits. I'm used to it at this point. Control, 2,500. I guess it's not bad. I've, I've bought more expensive fruits than this. That is almost half of what I got, though. Anyway, so I didn't buy that. We go. Oh, we started with two moves. Control area and levitate. Uh, I guess that makes sense. You kind of do need the room to use any of the moves, so. As you guys can see, I have about seven hours almost of two times codes loaded up on here. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, control area. Okay, okay, we levitate. Does this do anything? Oh, you drop rocks on him? Wow, okay. Oh, dude, that actually has good AoE, so I might actually be able to fight multiple people at once at this. All right, I'm not gonna lie, this is looking pretty bad. I don't even know where all the NPCs went. This has super high knockback. I don't know if this is gonna be good for grinding, boys. This might have got my work cut off for me with this one. All right, this will get us the first quest completed. Wait, you can throw buildings? I don't even know that. This one for sure will kill him. There we go, level 10. We can now go to the jungle. Okay, we pulled up to the jungle. And you know what? I just realized something. We're not going to get our next control move up until 150 mastery. Do you know how long it's going to take us? We'll be like well over half through the first seat before we can get our second move. So I'm not going to lie. I'm going to go ahead and go to the shop and uh, buy some things to make this easier for us. Go ahead and get two times mastery. Yep. Pay to win. Kinda, but do I care? Nope. Gotta defeat a bunch of these monkeys. Seeing as we only do 71 damage per attack, this is going to take us a minute. Boom. Boom. There we go. That's one of the monkeys. All right, we have one more monkey. Get him. And there we go. We are now level 17, which means we've evolved from monkeys to gorillas. Last levitate. And boom. Oh, okay. I forgot to record that part, but we can go to the next island now. But I'm not going to lie. I think I have a better method in mind. We are on our way to the marine fort over there. Now, my goal is to farm on these chief petty officers for quite a little bit. We're level 30 right now. I think I'll stay here until I can go to desert. Okay. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay. So we're up to 43 mastery and level 38. Looks like the strategy might actually work out after all. Come on. Two more. There we go. Do that one. And we're level Damn, 66. Boy. We can now go to the desert. We also got a bunch of points available. I'm just going to go ahead and put it all in box fruits. Is that smart? Probably not, but I like high damage. So, okay. I'm in a brand new server while I'm causing havoc. Die. Yeah. I got 238 body from him. Easy. Hold on. Can I get this guy too? Okay, never mind. That dude doesn't have combat in, but I'll take your kill. Easy, easy. All right, this next one should get me to 75. Okay. All right, and we are now level 90. Now we can go to Frozen Village. And well, at Frozen Village, there's a couple important things we need to buy. Yes, sir. I've been waiting for this one. First of all, we need air jump. Got that. And then the last thing is we need ore so we can deal that extra damage. You feel me? Boom. Anyways, we got business to take care of. We got quests to do, so let's get to it. Let's get to it. Room. I just realized it might be tough to fight here because... Oh, wait, hold on. Hold on, I'm in combat. Okay, hold on. Let me get him, let me get him, let me get him. Think you can get away from me, buddy? Boom. And we got him. Look at that. Look at that. Easy. All right, we got our next quest available. And then hold on. Go fight the Yeti. Boom. All right, we got the Yeti right where I want him. Look, he thinks I have my PvP on. I, I don't got my PvP on, bro. You're not going to be able to hit me. Goofy. One more hit for the Yeti. There we go. Okay, 106, 107, 108. Dang it. 110. All right, though, we're just going to keep server hopping to uh, continuously fight the Yeti. Here we go. Here we go. Last Yeti right here. Also, somewhat good news. We have 94 mastery and control, which means we will end up getting our next move, Echo Knife, soon. I think we should now be able to do the Vice Admiral. Yes, sir. Let's go see if he's even spawned though oh easier okay say less all right let me reactivate my control area well, i'll be able to do it in here that doesn't that doesn't really work i gotta i guess i gotta go outside let me deliver him outside come on out vice admiral Ooh, i forgot he has those long range attacks all right let's see how this works kind of a little bit janky but what can you do this is annoyingly tedious to fight i cannot lie but let's see how many levels we get we started at 130 Jeez, like seven levels from that thing all right bet yo and we got the code i didn't even realize that all right cool okay Next server, we're gonna be here for a bit. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you. Eventually. 20 minutes later. Uh. Later that same evening. Okay, yo, I forgot to record that part. I'm gonna be honest, I'm sorry about that, but new quest available, so we got to level 220. Anywho, we're about to go to the prison next. And the reason why I stayed at Marine Fort for so long was actually genius. Now we can just straight up go to the warden quest. It means we don't have to farm these boring NPCs. Not gonna lie, fighting the NPCs at the prison is 
tough. It, it's a grind. Okay, okay, I found a server with him, but there's a Gummu fighting him, so let me just go ahead and get some hits in. Oh, I did not mean to hit you, Gum user. I, I'm very sorry. I meant to hit the warden. Don't don't be mad at me. Don't be mad at me. Hold on. Is he coming towards me? Where did the warden go? Okay, there he is, right there. There we go. Okay, nice, nice. Warden down. Ah, oh, dude, that sucks. Look, Swan's right there, bro, but we're not high enough level to accept that quest. Well, I will tell you this. If you thought we stayed at Marine Ford for a long time, we're about to stay here for even longer. We're going to completely skip over the Colosseum Island just because this type of fruit, it's really only good to fight as many bosses as possible. Okay, we're level 241. We can now fight the Swan himself. Let me see. Can I use my thing in here? Uh, I don't think it's going to go inside. You guys see it kind of collides with the ceiling. Come on, come on, come on out here, Swan. I should be able to fight him just like this. All right, and boom. Eric, why? Why? Why did he feel the need to do that? Okay, now we should get our final move. Yes, sir. 150 mastery. Okay, Echo Knife. Let's see what this thing talking about. Echo Knife. Ooh. Okay, okay. All right, how much damage did that do? Actually, that actually did a decent amount of damage. Cooldown on that one is a lot longer than the Levitate one, but with those two mixed together, farming should be a lot easier now. Echo Knife. We're level 326 right now. Now 329. As soon as we get to 350, we skedaddle. Finally, 350. Okay. Woo. All right, though, let's see what the ad... Okay, never mind. He's not here. Room. Uh, I don't know what this move is called. I'm just saying Echo Knife. I don't know what Law calls it. Type it down in the comments below, but... Boom. Oh, yeah, this dude ain't got nothing on me. This dude ain't got nothing on me. Echo Woo. Knife. Oh. I mean, I guess it still lands anyways. <laughs> and last but not least... Okay, never mind. This time, Masculine at least. There we go. Okay, easy. I ain't gonna lie, very easy. And we got about four levels from that. This grind is taking its toll on me, though. I will say that. Okay, another day, another Magma Admiral. Gone. Easy. Finally, on the last Akainu. I've been farming this guy for like an hour straight, bruh. Glad to say we're finally about done with it. And he is dead. There we go. Now we can go to Underwater City and we'll be able to instantly fight uh, Neptune, I think. The next day. All right, we're level 502 now. <laughs> now you're probably sitting here wondering why did I just like skip like 100 levels plus? Well, you see, for me, it's it's the next day right now. Anyways, we go to Sky Islands next. So I yeah, probably have already figured it out at this point, but we're going to be fighting Weisper um, because he's a boss and I don't want to have to farm the NPCs. All right, Weisper, let's see what you got. Let's see what you got, bro. This is supposed to be the hardest boss we fought yet. Although the strategy to fight him is pretty simple. We're just going to stand right here. Use our Levitate. Go ahead and use Echo Knife. Boom, boom, boom. Hack him up. All right, he's one tap. And boom, there we go. Okay, 503, 504, 505, 506. Four levels. Here goes another Weisper. I honestly lost count of how many times I've done this, but oh, hey, we got an Angel Wings. Boys, y'all ain't gonna believe this. This ain't scripted. I ain't plant this here. There's straight up a portal right on this tree, and I just spawned in this server. There's no way, bro. <laughs> There's no way. Look at that. Look at that. That's proof. This is lit, bro. We just got a portal. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right. Finally, we are about to be able to go to Water Fallen. Yes, sir. And we got the bazooka. Okay, I guess that's cool. There's just one more quick thing I want to get before we end up going to Underwater City, and that is Observation Hockey. But we will have to go through the Shanks Puzzle Quest in order to do that. And obviously, the first step to doing the Shanks Puzzle is going to the forest right over there. What we actually came here to do is we have to unlock a bunch of different um foot tablets which is right here yeah over here and then there's another one on that tree right over there right there there we go that should be all of them there boy all right let me take this torch and then we're gonna go to desert island all right go in here come down here burn this curtain right here now we take this cup with this cup we go and take it over to the snow island so you guys can see that little dripping icicle right there just fill this cup up with come all the way up here go in this middle house and feed it to the sick poor man now he's gonna have us go try to find his son which will be at the buggy pirate island village now we've got to look for the rich man which there he is right there yes sir thanks for having my father but a mob leader has stolen all my money please find and take him down as soon as possible so i can reward you say less this little mini island right here we're gonna fight a boss on this and then we'll finally be able to progress to the last step of this puzzle anyways we're about to actually easily pack this dude up i should hit him with okay never mind i thought i was gonna one tap him but two tap will do two tap will do there we go. Damn. As you guys can see, I got a relic down there. And what you do with this relic is you got to go back to the area where this puzzle first started. All this back and forth for this quest. But trust me, it's going to pay off by the time we're done with it. Put the relic in the thingy thing. And Shanks is not here. That's that's weird. Room. All right. Let's see how much of a fight this guy is. He's only level 200 boss. So see how much of a fight this guy hit him in here with the levitate. Nice. I got my Reco knife back. You're done. You're done, buddy. Easy. Cool. 
we now have the ability to learn instinct. Very useful ability. Of course, this boy Usopp is about to literally tax us of all of our money. I mean, look at this. 750000 Crazy amount. But we had to buy it anyways. Ah, uh, yes. Our final destination for first seat. By the way, boys, we're one mastery away from getting our next move, which is teleport. Anyways, as I was saying, I don't know if I'm too excited for this move. I think it's just going to be a mobility move since the name is literally teleport. Let's see it. For as long as that took me to get, that's kind of underwhelming, bro. You can only use it once, too. It's not even like the way Law uses it. <laughs> that's crazy. I mean, does it go as far as I want it to? Take care of him here. Boom. And we're level 675. Close, boys. We're close to the second C. And now, finally, we are about ready to go to second C, boys. There we go. Level 776. Stat check right here, just in case any of y'all boys are interested in what I've been running. Anywho, forget what I'm saying. We go into the second C, baby. This is where the fun begins. Here we go. Here we go. Yes, sir. Look at that, bro. I'm not going to lie. Out of all the noob pros I've done, this is the longest it's ever taken me to get to second C, bro. It's kind of sad. The second C is also where I'll be getting both the Zebra Cat and the Cocoa Sword as they drop from order. Anyways, we're on these Swan Pirates now, which we are going to be farming here for a little bit, just like how we were at Water 7. Luckily, I do three-shot these boys, so farming them is relatively easy. At long last, we're at 349 Mastery, one away from getting our final move, which is Gamma Rush. Oh, I'm excited for this one. Better not be garbage. This last one should do it. Please, please. 518. There we go. Ooh. 350 mastery. Let's go. Let's go. New skill available. Gamma Rush. Okay, let's check this thing out. Check this thing out. Okay, let me go ahead and just reactivate my room. Gamma Rush. Ooh. Wait. Wait. Am I hitting everybody? Yo, look at the damage. Damn. Yo, that's got a long ass cooldown though. But that was sick. Did I just hit everyone? Look at that. I hit everyone in the circle. No way. That's actually fire, bro. Now that we got Gamma Rush, it's so much easier to farm. Like, look, I just hit one of them. Now, next thing you know, I'm attacking everybody in the entire circle. It's so much easier to farm like this. And now we're finally going to get to move on to the next place. Level 926. We can go to the green zone. But before we actually go to green zone, there's one thing I want to take care of, and that's actually getting V2. I believe my race is human right now. I've never used human race before. So, so the first step towards getting V2 is we have to talk to this guy bartillo he's gonna give us a quest where we have to defeat 50 of those swan pirates that we just got done farming for like hours anyways we get 35 million xp from that all right last one right here i kind of just skipped over all that because y'all have seen me fight enough of these damn pirates now we need to defeat jeremy the spring spring user which is uh relatively easy i've already done that a bunch of time let's just go ahead and try to pack him up though with gamma rush this boss should be cake for us now with gamma rush before wait who in combat who am i hitting here's a strategy i could use now that i'm low i could literally just run and use levitate since levitate has a non-existent cooldown. Now it's time to say goodbye. Tournament is back to normal. Go now. Free the imprisoned gladiators who are jailed beneath the stadium. Okay. All right. So in this mansion, on this table right here, there's like a little code. I'm going to go ahead and get my snipping tool out so we can uh, do this. All right. We're here. Now we pull out that puzzle. First one is this one right here. Second one is uh, this one right here. Like sideways hourglass. Now we have this one over here. And then after the F, we have this. And last but not least, this. There we go. And we got a warrior helmet. I don't really know if that's good or not. I've never even worn it before but anyways now that we've freed the brothers we're gonna go over to green zone v2 hello it appears you haven't unlocked your maximum potential yet blah 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 if you're seeking more power i need you to bring me three different flowers spread across the entire map all right let's go okay found one of the blue flowers on this graveyard island can i get it there we go flower one Oh, there we go. We just got flower three, or yellow flower. Nice. Now I just got to wait till daytime, and uh, hopefully we'll get the red flower soon. Oh, there's a red flower right here. Hold on. Let me see. Got it. Got it. Wait, wait. Did I just steal from that guy? Hold on. Hold on. We better squeeze. Why are you pulling me? Oh, let me start running. Let me start running. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Alchemist, hurry up and take it. Hurry up and take my money. Okay, boom. Thanks. I've enhanced your flash step cooldown and range and added one extra dodge to your instinct ability. Wow. Human V2 is actually not bad. No, the dude said I need race V2. That's the dude I stole the flower from. That's crazy. Hey, right, but now we got race V2. Let's go ahead and fight Fajita. Room. Shampoos. I don't even think we have shampoos here, do we? Yo, don't roast me in the comments, boys. I'm not caught up to one piece. Yes, sir. Dice him up. Dice him up. Bah. All right, they should kill him. They should kill him. There we go. Nice. There we go. Level 964. Okay, we're on our last run right now. We leave here at level 1,000. Wait, did I just kill someone? Hold on, hold on. Let me chill. Let me chill. Let me chill. Come on, die, Fujitora. Okay, level 99. 1,000. There we go. Okay, now we can go over to Snow Mountain. Hey, hey, dog, don't... Bruh. Wait a minute, hold on, hold on. Is that a blizzard user trying to get me? All right, bet. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I didn't hit him, I didn't hit him. Got him, got him. Please. He has got you, but wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a damn minute. Oh, I hit the wrong one, hit the wrong one. Gamma rush, gamma rush. Boom. Got him, got him. Okay, okay. I don't know why there's a god human person here fighting me, but hey, man. Crazy things happen, crazy things happen. Am I actually about to win? No. He's not good. 
Oh, I killed him. I killed him. All right, I'm about to dip. I'm about to dip. Hold on. Hold on. By the way, we're level 1,151. We can go to hot and cold now. All right, finally got into a server with him. Now, how will I go about fighting this guy? Can I use my thing in here? Of course not. Well, I've got two moves I can use. Echo Knife and Gamma Rush now, so that's nice. Gamma Rush. Boom. Pack him up. See if I can get him outside here. Maybe I can fight him like that. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay. Could have just let me kill you right off rip, but... There we go. Two, three, three levels. Okay, that should go good. I already know how long I'm going to stay here. We're going to stay here until 1,250 until we can go to the cursed ship. Boom, boom, boom. Hit him with that. And we are level 1,219. And now, finally, we are about to leave hot and cold. All right, now we're on our way to the cursed ship. I'm going to be so mad if I end up not being able to use levitate in there. That'd be trash. All right, let's find out. Oh, I can. Nice, nice. Okay, okay, okay. Cool. I would about to be upset, bro, if I couldn't use levitate in here, but the roof is pretty high up, so I think... We should be good. Yeah, I take back what I said earlier, bro. This is actually a little bit difficult to farm in. The next day. Boys, we're finally almost level 1400. Well, we are at 1400, but as you guys can see, I switched places. It honestly took way too damn long at the curse ship, so I just switched here. But after we get to level 1500, we're gonna start farming law and we're gonna get V3. That's really where the fun stuff is for me, getting V3. Yes, sir, I got my boy Rip guy and Cam Cam. They pulled up, they wanted to help me farm a little bit. And you know, since I got control and it's bad for grinding, I don't got no qualms with that. But forget what I'm talking about. We are level 1498, boys. We about to go to third C, third C. We almost there. Boom, let me go all special. Let me go all special, Gamma Rush. We gotta pull out all the stops for this one. Boom, 1500, baby, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look at that. Congratulations. Reaching 1500. Ready to go to the next world. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Now that we're level 1500, we're not going to go to third C just yet. We've still got to get the Coco Sword and the Zebra Cap, as well as V3. Now, the Zebra Cap is 100% chance to drop, so I'm not really worried about that one. But it's the Coco Sword that has a 5 to 10% chance. That might take us a little bit. Since these two boys didn't have fragments, I had to get the microchip. All good, though. Let's get the raid on the way. I want to get the first hit. Let me go. Boom. Got him, got him, got him. Order. So like I said earlier, the Zebra Cap does have a 100% chance of... Oh, wait, what? I missed the move? Okay, hold on. Oh, what, what is my stat spreadsheet looking like? No. Oh, oh, this is bad. 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 No way. I just died. Okay, first time obviously went terrible. Let's go for round two, baby. Round two. Straight off rip. I need to get my uh, Gamma Rush. Please, come on. All right. All right. Get as much damage as possible. Try to pack that boy up. Now I just got to try to hit him as much as possible. Okay, let me get him there while he's still there. Okay, got him. Boy, this guy is so hard to hit. I don't even know what to do. Got him. Got him. Okay, okay. Got him with this. Got him with this. That should be able to get some decent damage. What am I even saying? That should be able to get me some decent damage. Anyways. There we go. Oh, got the zebra cap. Got the zebra cap. Okay, we didn't get the uh, the Coco Sword, so we're going to have to run that back. Okay, on our next run. Okay, we didn't get the Coco Sword once again, but we do get a bunch of levels. So, hey, this is, this is still paying off in some way or another. All right, we're on the third run right now. This boy's being extra annoying this time. Though I got him. Got him, my Gamma Rush. There we go. Damn, still no Coco Sword? I right. <sighs> Something tells me it's going to take me a long time to get this sword, man. Come on, drop me that damn Coco Sword, please. Come on. Yes, yes, we got Coco. We got Coco. Let's go. Check, check me out, check me out. Hey, look at that hockey on it, though. The flowy hockey. I like that, I like that. All right, though, boys, we got the Zebra Cap and the Coco Sword. We're going to be mastering this Coco Sword as we go throughout third C. But for now, let's go ahead and uh, get V3. All right, so I'm going to do a Block Streets Gotcha real quick just because I'm, I might need it. Bang, one for Ooh, ooh, no way. New title unlock. Look at the draw. No way. That's two for two, bro. Earlier, we got the portal fruit. All right, now we go to Arrow, and let's see what Arrow has to tell us. Talk to me once you defeat Jeremy, Fajita, and Diamond. Okay, so that's actually relatively easy. It's not too, too hard. Diamond is up here. This is actually good for us, because this way we'll be able to get some uh, mastery on the Coco Sword. Get some damage on that. Get some damage with the Coco Sword. Sorry, more mastery. Okay, 122. All right, Jeremy, we meet again, bro. We meet again. Let's go ahead, pack him up, pack him up. Yes, sir, get that damage, get that damage. I gotta try to get as much damage as possible. All right, y'all can go ahead and kill him. Last but not least, Fajita. That's actually a really easy V3 to get. I thought he would be harder, but you know what I'm saying? Even if I was solo, I'd be able to do this relatively easy. All right, Fajita. Time to meet your doom, buddy. All right, let me hit him with one more move. All right, get him. Get him. There you go. Pack him up. Pack him up. Yes, sir. All right, say less. 139. We almost got our first move, which is electric stab. Hold well on. I like many guys before me. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. He's going to take my 2 million. Let's go ahead and get it. Unlocked full power. Last resort. I wonder what that does, bro. It says right here, last resort. All it does is increase the damage you do, the lower your HP is. Actually, Actually could be kind of clutch because let's say you're getting teamed or something and your health is low you do more damage all right ladies and gentlemen let's go ahead
ahead and make our way to third seat. Here we are, we in Port Town. Damn, never thought I'd make it here, bro, with how long that was taking. But at least now I have something to look forward to with unlocking the moves for Coco, because after I unlocked all the moves control, it got a little bit more boring for me, so. Damn, bro, why do I always level up or like unlock moves when I'm not recording? You guys saw it right there. I just unlocked the electric stab. Let's just go ahead and check that thing out. Electric stab. Damn, okay. That was actually quick. I barely even could keep up with that. Let me go ahead and check that out again. Let me see how that like combos with anything. Boom. Oh, that's nice. I like that. I like that. That's nice. I switched my stats to a more sword centric build just so I can uh, level up my sword easier. All right, here we go, boys. Here we go. We're about to finally unlock the last move of Coco Sword. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. All right, 325. Let's go. Injection shot through. Ooh, wait a minute. Yo, look at that. We got the little aim thing. All right, say less. Damn. All right, we are level 1675 now. We can finally move on to Amazon Lily to fight Boy oh, Hancock. Hancock. All right, we got the Island Empress quest right here. She should be spawned. We've been in here for like an hour. Yes, sir. Boom. Injection shot too. Pack her up. Boom. Room. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Hold on. Back up, back up. Boa Hancock is no more. Okay, never mind. Now she's no more. There we go. Man, this grind, this grind is starting to hit. We're almost there, man. We're almost there. Levels 1721. A few moments later. Oh, finally, bro. Finally. I've been grinding for hours. Wait, wait, die. Die, bro. There we go. Okay. We're level 2000. We only have 450 more levels to go. And I know that was a huge, massive time skip. But you guys have already seen me farm enough. God damn it. Y'all have already seen me farm enough. It's actually getting harder to grind with control over time, which doesn't really make sense to me. But hey, we move on to our final destination of the video before we wrap it up. We go into Sea of Trees, baby. Room. Ejection shot too. And now we're level 2300, boys. We're almost there, though. Almost there. Just 150 more levels to go. What's that? Ooh. All right, boys. Me and my friends, we found a method. We found a method to level up quicker. And what that method is, is fighting law. Apparently, law gives guaranteed three levels. I use two times EXP. So we have a guaranteed six levels per run. And it's it's very quick. So we're doing this. We're guaranteed to be able to get to max after I'm down to fragments. 2400. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Ooh, we almost there. We almost there. Just 50 more levels to go. We got this. We got this. Boom. Got him with my ult. Got him. Got him. Okay, what level will we end up getting to? 40? Okay, we only have 10 more levels to go. We only need to do two more runs. Ooh I'm starting to get hyped, boys. I'm starting to get hyped. Ooh, this is it. This is it, boys. This is it. I'm getting hyped. I'm getting hyped. I'm getting hyped. Okay. 248, 249. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my God. Finally, boys. Finally. This took me a week straight. Control is not good for grinding. Don't recommend you eat this fruit. This was such a crazy challenge. Let me know what y'all think about the face cam. 10,000 likes for me to bring the face cam back. And with that said, I'm about to go on a little bit of a trip. So I'm finna get some rest, go to sleep, and I'll see y'all on the next one.